In 2015, Americans generated 262.4 million tons of trash. 137.7 million tons ended up in landfills across the United States. Humans generate tons of waste, not just from the products we use and dispose of, but biological waste as well. Where does this waste end up? What effect does all this waste have on the environment? Unfortunately, as citizens, we contribute to this global problem daily. It takes a toll on the environment and impacts all living things on Earth. For example, the plastic we use and throw away can leach toxic chemicals into the land and sea. As our world population continues to skyrocket, what can we do about our waste? While there is an increase in recycling initiatives, there is still a major threat as the world population continues to grow. Some leaders in the industry have taken a step towards sustainability by finding creative ways to lighten their environmental footprint. An example of this is a clothing company who makes recycled polyester from plastic soda bottles. This polyester is then used in their clothing. This innovation helps turn trash into an important fiber for their products. Another example of sustainability is turning manure into energy. Anaerobic digestion and combustion are the most common processes used to generate electricity from biological waste. Some hog farms and cattle operations use this method for sustainable energy. How can we improve the ways in which waste products are disposed? Consider how waste can be disposed of differently or how it could be transformed into something useful. First, get a group together and discuss the long-term effects of waste. Then, produce a model solution of innovative ways to reuse waste. Lastly, create and share a presentation that communicates what you've learned. Be sure to share your progress and results on social media by tagging the Purple Plow. We can't wait to see what you come up with for the Waste Not, Want Not Purple Plow Challenge.